May I introduce you to Duet AI in Firebase. It's an in-console collaboration tool powered by Google Cloud's Duet AI, and it can help you reach higher levels of productivity when working with Firebase. Through a simple chat window, you can quickly chat with Duet AI in Firebase to get answers to your Firebase questions or even recommendations on how to ensure your app is the best it can be, no matter your skill level. There's this tool called Firebase App Distribution. It's a developer tool that you can use to distribute pre-release apps and get feedback from your testers. But now it also has a new feature called an automated tester. This automated tester will crawl your app, try to click things, try to break things, all that good stuff. I mean, it sounds cool, but how does it work? It uses a technique called app crawling. This means that it will identify UI elements and interact with those elements. It basically tries to mimic the behavior of a real user. Now, you can add Windows as a platform, and voila! You can run your Flutter app with your Firebase implementation on your desktop, saving your time and ultimately improving your productivity. While you're out there coming up with ideas and building your app, Project IDX with integrated Firebase hosting workflows takes away a lot of the boilerplate and grunt work and lets you focus on the important stuff. The first is a new release monitoring dashboard powered by Crashlytics that will allow you to monitor the adoption and stability of your new app release all in real time. The second feature we've been working on is rollouts in remote config. Rollouts will combine the power of Crashlytics, Google Analytics, and remote config to allow you to gradually ramp up traffic to new features while keeping an eye on your app's performance. So last but not least, here's one more feature to make your developer experience more delightful. Introducing Dark Mode, a sleek new style option for you to enjoy. And Dark Mode isn't only for the console. We've also updated our blog, our Firebase website, and docs. 